Okay, the knot for this Friday is the clove hitch. The clove hitch is used to secure a lashing uh, or just secure a rope at the end of the line kind of temporarily. Uh, it also was said that uh, I was told a long time ago it was used, the cowboys used to secure their uh, horses to the rail with it. So clove hitch, uh, we need some type of a rail or a stick or uh, I have a wooden spoon here and our rope. Our first step is we're going to go over our rail or our spoon here, and then we're going to go underneath and on the right side of the spoon here, as you see. Next step, we're going to go over your spoon or stick, and then we're going to go, next step is under and pull it. And then once again, we dress all of our knots down. And then that's what a clove hitch looks like when it's finished. Really easy knot. If you look, I pull on, it's secure. And you just pull up this top here and it comes right off. So once again, we have our spoon or our stick and our rope. We're going to go over once on the right side, then underneath. And then we're gonna go over top again, and then underneath in the middle. And then once again, we, we pull it tight and dress it down. And then that's our clove hitch. And if you look, I pull on it and it's secure. And then I just undo this knot and then it comes undone. Once again, with our stick or my wooden spoon here in your rope, we go over top underneath on the right side next step over and then we go underneath and through the middle and then once again we dress our knot down nice and tight and then once again two twist together, put it in, and you tighten it down, and then that's your clove hitch there. All right, so once again, the shortcut, twist one in, twist the other in, join them on the back like this, so it looks like that, and then you stick your pipe or your pole through there, and then you just pull it tight, and then once again, it looks like our clove hitch. Well, that's the end of the knots for today. Uh, I hope you guys all have a good weekend. Goodbye.